à zéro moins une minute. We're into the final 60 seconds. Give us a chance to say hello to our friends at ISRO in Bengaluru, to our friends at Arabsat, to Inmarsat tonight in London, Hellasat uh, people in Athens and in Larnaca in Cyprus, to the Talis Alenia space teams in Cannes and Toulouse, hello locally to the Kourou Cinemari and Cayenne sites, to our industrial partners ISA and Kness, and to all of you following the broadcast on the internet. We hope you are enjoying it. If you're not settled in, pull up a chair and enjoy the launch because we're going to cut away and let you listen to the DDO and he will call out the final seconds. Remember, the cryo arms will open at about minus seven seconds. A tous de DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcan. Allumage UAP, décollage. Les paramètres de bord sont nominaux. Lifting off La propulsion est nominale. In French Guiana, with a lot of fire. Nice shot of the birds on the port side as she took off. I don't know if you could see that. The DDO is saying that everything is going smoothly on board as Ariane begins her mission, the seventh for Ariane Space. Tous les paramètres à bord sont normaux. Two new satellites for new services for new customers around the globe. The two boosters are providing 90% of our thrust right now, propelling the launcher along her trajectory at an ever higher velocity. 774 tons is her mass at liftoff. She's burning five tons of fuel per second, 2.5 tons in each booster, plus the core stage in the middle is burning another 300 kilos of fuel every second. And Ariane 5 now following the program in her onboard computer, which is located on the upper stage. This gives all the orders, including stage separations, which we will. La propulsion est nominale, la trajectoire est nominale, tous les paramètres à bord sont normaux. Propulsion and trajectory normal, says the DDO. We're in the first of four flight phases. We'll describe each in turn and in detail, so you can follow Ariane as she heads east across the Atlantic. Right now, the first flight phase. The single first, first stage engine and the two boosters are burning. The boosters will each consume 240 tons in just over two minutes, another 20 seconds roughly for them to burn. They'll be the first to be extinguished. You'll hear that also Tous of course, from the DDO. We're 15 kilometers from the pad here in, in uh, Jupiter, and the sound Separation is just coming des deux over. All right, those are the separation of the two boosters. You saw that. The DDO confirmed it. This is what it looks like up there. There is one on the left-hand side of the vehicle, outside of, uh, out of the camera range. Before the boosters are empty, their push diminishes in the onboard computer, the same one, senses this drop in acceleration and separates them. And they fall 500 kilometers from shore into a protected area. French Guiana was in part, remember, chosen as a base for its opening on the ocean. Launch is posing no threat to local population. Take a look at the bottom of your screen on the left altitude, on the right our speed. We're over 100 kilometers and we're past two kilometers per second. We're getting close to the separation of the fairing, which will be next up. And 